Elon Musk at Twitter, who could replace him as chief executive? Hi everyone, welcome to AI News. Elon Musk is considering his next step after Twitter poll asking if he should step down as chief executive. More than 17 million people had their says, with 57.5% voting yes, leaving the next obvious question being, if not Mr. Musk, who? The billionaire who has been at the helm of the social platform since October said he would abide by the results of the poll. But he has not made any announcements regarding plans to leave his position. No one wants the job who can actually keep Twitter alive, he tweeted following the poll. Bob O'Donnell from Tech Handless Research warned that trying to predict who might take over the social platform was a pointless exercise because of how unpredictable and short-lived every decision regarding Twitter has been in the mask era. Even so, we take a look at who might be in their running. Mr. Mask poll was posted last hour after he was seen at the New Sale Stadium in Qatar, where he watched Argentina's beat France on penalties to win the Men's Football World Cup. He was at the game alongside Jared Kushner, a former US president advisor, and Donald Trump's son-in-law. The picture of the men flooded Twitter with viewers questioning their relationship. A close confidant of Mr. Musk is Sri Ram Krishna, an Indian technocrat who has tasked by a billionaire for monetize the platform. He is the one of few to be included in Mr. Musk's core team at Twitter. Will Elon Musk ultimatum post him Twitter? Who is Elon Musk? Mr. Krishna, who is a former Twitter, Meta and Microsoft employee, is also an investor technologist and engineer who hosts a podcast and YouTube channel with his wife. I invested and am interested in intersections of consumer tech and crypto, he says on his website. He lists pro wrestling of one of his interests and believes in the importance of making a big entrance. Something that perhaps chimes with Mr. Musk, technology investor and podcaster David Sachs in another one of the experienced name in Mr. Musk inner art circle. Mr. Sachs was involved at the beginning of PayPal with Mr. Musk and is a member of so-called PayPal Mafia. A group of former executives of firm who have become millionaire by founding some of Silicon Valley's most successful tech big businesses. Jack Dorsey, co-founder of Twitter, Jack Dorsey has stepped into run into ice, so could it be third time lucky? Arguably, there is nobody who knows the platform better than Mr. Dorsey who resigned as chief executive in November 2021. He had been serving as chief executive of both Twitter and payment firm Square and had been under pressure from investors who felt Twitter was not getting the focus it needed while he was running Square. Mr. Dorsey not only excreted himself from Twitter, but he also gave up his board seat so has no, had no involvement under Mr. Musk apart from initially being supportive for his takeover. Sarah Pillar, Ms. Sarah Pillar was previously finance and boss at Square, the payment company set up by Mr. Dorsey. She is now the chief executive of Nextdoor, a social network that centers around local neighborhoods. She has been described as one of the most highly regarded executives in Silicon Valley with an exceptional rare mix of proven business skills, an authentic heart and soul. David Marcus, another member of the PayPal Mafia. Mr. Marcus is the former president of PayPal and is close to Mr. Musk. He was one of the first tech leaders to embrace cryptocurrencies. He was previously a top-ranking executive at Facebook's parent company Meta, heading up the firm cryptocurrencies project Deem and Messenger. He was also on the board of Coinbase, a cryptocurrency exchange platform. He now runs crypto-focused company Lightspark, which is working on extending the capabilities of Bitcoin. If Mr. Musk's future plan for making profits from Twitter include integrating cryptocurrency into existing products and service, then Mr. Marcus might be a leading candidate, formerly the chief operating officer of Meta and Mark Zuckerberg, right-hand woman Sheryl Sandberg resigned from the role in June to focus on her philanthropic work. She was seen as largely transforming Facebook's revenue strategy, positioning the platform to make profits from small businesses, advertising, and being at the helm during the 
Metrotic Rice. Could the top job at Twitter tempt her back into one of the biggest roles in Silicon Valley? Parag Gagawal, when Mr. Musk completed his takeover of Twitter, he immediately slacked the former boss Parag Agawal. Co-founder Mr. Dorsey handpicked successor. His slacking marked the beginning of the chaotic Musk era, so might Mr. Musk want some stability to bring him back. Edward Snowden, one of the only people to throw their hat into the ring, albeit jokingly is Edward Snowden, the National Security Agency, whistleblower Mr. Snowden has been living in exile in Russia since he leaked details of extensive internet and phone surveillances by U.S. intelligence agencies. But given his response charges in the U.S., it would be seem running. Twitter would be rather difficult from Moscow. Thank you.